Hi, I'm Mira from Malaya Pilates, a Bassi host studio based in Jakarta, Indonesia, and from Flow with Mira YouTube channel. Welcome to the beautiful island of Belitung in Sumatra, Indonesia. And special thanks to Sheraton Belitung Resort for the beautiful location of today's class. Today I'm sharing with you my holiday fluid flow class. The class will be based on the Bassi Pilates mat principle created by Ryle Asakowitz. So when you're ready, let's begin the class. We're going to stand upright. So come towards the front of the mat. I'm going to stand slightly diagonal for the camera's sake. So we're going to find our standing position. Half your feet, hip width distance apart, approximately about a fist between the heels. Now I'd like you to find that long, tall position. Inhaling for me, breathing in that beautiful ocean, fresh air. Now I'd like you to lift all five, not five, all ten toes upward and feel the lift of the arch of the feet rising up through the legs slight softening on the knees here and feel the energy of the arch powering up your thigh muscle your quads your hamstrings up towards your pelvis here and now keep the energy lifting up through the legs and i like you to just spread the toes down back to the floor and keep the arch of the feet lifting up now if you have a tendency to have a slight hip extension on the knees, I like you to think about rolling back the outer thighs and then lifting up that kneecap up towards the pelvis. You should feel that pelvic floor lifting up, creating a nice strong center here. Now with that power in the legs, we inhale. Now as you exhale, let's roll down, not the head down. Start rolling the spine down, articulating vertebrae by vertebrae, down to the floor. Softening through the knees, bringing the pelvis down. Take your body down wherever you feel comfortable today. We inhale. Exhale. Let's roll up. Keep the arch of the feet lifting up. Lifting the center. Coming up that beautiful tall position. Inhale. Exhale, as we roll down again, towards the floor, softening through the knees, strong in the arch of the feet, inhale, exhale, we roll up, right up to that standing position, inhale. Exhale, let we roll down again. Softening through the knees, tipping the pelvis forward. And now here, as you inhale, I like you to lengthen the spine, softening through the knees a little deeper here, coming to a little half squat position here. And stay here as we inhale, finding the length of the spine. Exhale. Drawing in the center. Two more breaths. Inhale. Feeling the power of the hamstring supporting you. Exhale. Deepening through the center. Inhale. Lengthening through the spine, through the fingertips, through your nail. Exhale. Drawing to the center. Now inhale, lower the body down again. And I like you to straighten the leg as much as you can. Elongate the spine here. Now here, I like you to bend your left knee. And then take the right arm up to the sky. The sky for me, the ceiling for you perhaps. Reach up nice and tall, straightening the right leg. Find that rotation in the spine. We inhale, lengthen and lift up, exhale, take the arm down, other side, inhale, straightening the left leg, left arm up to the sky, bending through the right knee, 
as you inhale, can we lift a little bit more? Exhale, drawing the center. One more time. Inhale. Exhale, drawing the center. And then take it down. Let's do one more set. Inhale, straightening the right leg. Left knee softened. Right arm up to the sky. Inhale, reach tall, reach long. Exhale. One more. Inhale, reach up. Exhale. And take the arm down. Last one here. Inhale. As we rotate. Exhale. Center nice and strong. Inhale. Reach up to the sky. Exhale. And then let it go. And now here, I like to soften the knees and then start rolling the spine back up. In breath. Exhale, we roll down again. Let's take our body right down to the ground. Bend the knees a little deeper if you need to today. And then take yourself into a deep squat here. So folding deep in the hips and the knees. Bring your hands behind the bottom. Sit the pelvis down. Take your feet forward into a diamond position here. Lifting tall in the spine. Perching on your sitting bone. Arms out to the side. Reaching the fingertips long away from each other. As we exhale, arms come forward. We round the spine to a C curve. We roll the spine back. Melting the sacrum and lower spine to the floor in breath. Exhale as we come up and over forward. Now here, take our spine into a beautiful diagonal flat back position here. Lifting upright, arms out to the T position. Arms forward into the C curve. We roll back, melting the sacrum, lower spine, in breath. Exhale, come up and over forward, reach long diagonally, lengthening through the spine here. And upright, arms to the T position. And C curve. We roll back, in breath. Exhale, over forward, inhale, diagonal, upright, T position. Last one here, exhale, we roll back, in breath, exhale, come forward, and then lifting tall, reach out long, and upright. Arms to the T positioned, and the next one we're going to transition ourselves to the ground here. And we roll back and stay in that chest lift positioned. Bring the knees parallel, bring the feet closer to a pelvis for a pelvic position. Arms down by the floor and head down. I'm just going to shuffle myself forward or down to the mat. Okay, ready for the pelvic curl. We in breath. Exhale, as we deepen abdominal, take our lower spine into a, a deep flexion to imprint the back down and peel the spine up to that bridging position. Arms are active, neck is long, inner thighs are working. The arch of your feet are lifting up through the legs, in breath. Exhale, as we roll the spine down, imprint after. Go further right down to the floor. In breath. Exhale. Deepening the abdominal to imprint the lower spine and peeling off using the hamstrings and then finish up with the glute. Inner thighs are active, pressing the big toes down to the floor. In breath. Exhale. As we articulate our spine down. And release back. And again. In breath. Exhale, we roll up, 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 and let's stay here. Hold that bridging position. I like you to dorsiflex your ankles. So your feet comes off the floor, your heels are down on the floor here. Exhale, roll the spine down and lift the arms up at the same time. Take your arms overhead. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, 
as we roll the spine up, take the arms up again and bring it down towards the feet side. In breath. Exhale. Roll the spine down, arms overhead. Reach long. In breath. Exhale. Roll the spine up again. And press your arms down. Hold that for a second. Lower the feet down. Plant a flex of feet. Lift the heels up here. So hold the pelvis in the same height. Then exhale, roll the spine down. Arms come up. Take the arms overhead. In breath. Exhale, roll the spine up. Take the arms down to the floor. In breath. Exhale, roll the spine down. Arms go overhead. In breath. Exhale, roll the spine up, arms come right down to the side, lower your heels down, hold that pelvis, press the arms a little bit more to the ground and lift the pelvis a little higher here. Press the big toes down so your inner thighs are awake. And then from here, exhale, we roll the spine down, dip flexion to every single vertebrae, take the arms overhead and return yourself back to that neutral spine position. Keep the arms overhead here, pressing the back of your arms down to the floor. Squeeze the inner thighs, duck the legs together. Let's just do spine to supine with the feet on the floor to me as we inhale. Rotating from the center. Inhale, the legs travel together as one unit. Exhale. Warming up the oblique muscle. Exhale. In breath. Exhale. Inhale. Last one here. Inhale. Center. Separate the feet and the legs. Back to parallel position, interlace the hands at the back of the head, ready for the chest lift here. Inhale, exhale, we'll lift. As we inhale, stretch your arms forward, lift a little higher. Exhale, arms return back and return the chest down. Again, exhale, inhale. Exhale, arms back, head down. Again, exhale, allow your lumbar spine to melt down to the floor as you lift. Inhale, lift up a little higher. Exhale, and down. Exhale, in breath. Exhale, now a little different. We're going to add a single leg slide here. So we exhale, we lift. And as you inhale, stretch one leg, one leg down closer to me. And then as you exhale, return the leg back, hands behind the head and return the spine down. Exhale, other leg. Inhale, reach the arms, slide the leg away. Exhale, return the leg, arms back. And return the chest down. One more set. Exhale. In breath. Reach. Exhale. And down. Last one here. Exhale. Inhale. Slide and reach forward. Exhale. And come back down. Exhale. And now the chest lift. And an inhale, grab the back of your thighs, lift the chest a little higher here. And then keep that new height and return your hands back behind to hit for the chest lift rotation towards me. Exhale, center, center, find the rotation from the waistline. I'm thinking about flexing forward as I rotate. Flex higher 
and rotate one more each side last one center hold now can we rotate towards me stay there stretch your arms forward into like a prayer hand here now hold that five little pulses forward exhale two three four five hold that new height hands behind the head center and other side stretch your arms forward exhale two three four five hold that new height hands behind the head center and return back down well done stretch your arms out to a T position float one leg up to tabletop hold the center bring the second leg up squeeze the inner thighs together for spine twist supine with double leg extension here so rotate towards me as you inhale now hold that extend both legs straight return yourself back to the middle and we bend the knee over to the other side as you inhale extend both legs straight return yourself back to the center and fold in breath extend the knees center bend the knees inhale extend center and fold last set in breath extend center we fold last one in breath we extend we return back to the middle and bending the knee take your arms overhead here for the hundreds prep exhale we'll lift inhale arms up return the chest down exhale lift inhale reach up high to the sky and return exhale inhale reach up and come down last one reach up and let's take it to the hundreds exhale reach the legs long in breath and we go can we scoop that down a little deeper so you really try to melt that lower back down to the floor three more sets two more last one hold draw the knees in grab the shin lift the chest higher and let's rock it up right up to rolling like a ball position so just readjust your hands slightly higher than above your ankle and then balance yourself to a tail on your tailbone deep abdominal scoop strong arms hold the position for rolling like a ball we go inhale exhale inhale exhale we find our balance in breath two more times last one here we balance now lengthen the spine open the knee slightly lift tall opening across the front of the chest we stay here inhale find that deep support from the pelvic floor rising up through the spine connected to the armpit connected to your arms and back to the legs and then bring the legs together now from here we're going to articulate down so we're going to roll the spine down so we articulate the spine away from the legs down to the floor double leg stretch 
just readjust the arms position here. We inhale, stretching arms and legs. Exhale, center. Inhale, reach out. Exhale, inhale. Three more. Two. Last. Hold that center. And then can we lift the chest a little higher? Stay there for three, two, one. And release the head down. Lower one foot down. Second leg down. Arms are to the tip position. And I'd like you to straighten the leg away from me. And then on the floor. And then bring the leg closer to me up to a tabletop position. And we extend the knee, dorsiflex the foot. Plant our legs, flex the knee. And extend the knee, dorsiflex the ankle. And planter, we bend. Last one, extend and dorsiflex, we stay. Plant our legs. And let's do a little five ankle rolls in one direction. Three, two, one. The other way. Five, four, three two, one, dorsiflex the ankle, stay there, let's go for the leg circle, across the body and down as you inhale, exhale, inhale, stay parallel, exhale, in breath, last set, stay other way, inhale, Last set, stay, plant the flex the foot, lift the hand and the chest up, grab the back of your calf, like I said, you're doing a hamstring pull one. Can we lift the chest a little higher? Can we pull the leg a little closer to your head? And stay here for three, two, one, release. Head down, chest down, arms out, bend the knee, lower the foot down, Bring the other leg in, stretch your first leg down on the floor to a tabletop and let's go extend the knee, dorsiflex the ankle and back. Again, extend, reach and back. Last one, extend, reach and stay. Let's go for the leg circle across, in breath. Exhale, in breath. Exhale, in breath. Exhale, last set. And reverse, and in breath. And inhale. Last set. Stay, point. Lift the head and the chest up, grab the back of your calf. Like hamstring pull wand. We stay here for three, two, one. Let's stay here. In fact, let's go to hamstring pull one, two, and three. When you're ready, double breath. We switch. Last set. And hold that. Now we've got the first leg up again, hands behind your head. Lift the chest a little higher, stay there for three, two, one. Switch the leg and we stay for three, two, one. Continue the hamstring pull two and we go. Change. Last set, and stay, grab the back of your calf, rotate to the front leg side, and stay there for three, two, one. Can you lift a little higher? Now hands behind the head, switch the leg, other side. Grab the back of your calf, lift up a little higher, for three, 
two, one, lift up, hands behind the head, continue, hamstring pull, three, last set, back to center, we hold, grab the back of your thigh, lift the chest a little higher, reach tall with the legs to the sky, arms long by the side, we stay, for three, deep in the abdominal, two, one, and stay up with the chest, bend the knee, slide the feet down, stretch the legs long, turn the palms facing your thigh, take an in breath, exhale, can we do this, can we roll up, pull in the center, pull up, up into that C curve, we made it, inhale for the roll up, exhale, we roll back, arms overhead again inhale and exhale Ooh, a little harder this time into that C curve in breath exhale we take ourselves down arms overhead again inhale exhale C curve and in breath Exhale, we roll back. Let's do one more. Inhale, exhale, up into that C curve. And let's just stay here. Lift the spine up tall, grab the ankles. Let's go into modify open leg rocker, and then we're going to a mo open leg rocker here. So lifting through the spine here. Now we inhale, we roll back. Exhale, we balance. We stretch the legs long, and we bend the knees again, and we roll back. Exhale, come forward. Inhale, reach the legs long. Exhale. Return. Inhale, rounding the back. And inhale, reaching the legs long. Exhale. Last one, like so. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, reach and stay here. Exhale, drawing the center nice and deep. And let's move on. Inhale, upper leg rocker with a straight leg. And exhale, lift. Again, in breath, exhale, and in breath, exhale, two more times, exhale, last one, exhale, reach, hold tall, hold tall, hold it here, dorsiflex your feet, hold that. Draw in the center, take your arms next to your ears. Hold, and then lower your feet down. Interlace your hands behind your head. Full spine stretch here. Okay, lifting nice and tall. Such nice breeze here. Excellent, inhale. Exhale. I wish you can feel the same way like I'm feeling right now. Beautiful breeze, beautiful sunshine. Now here I want you to lengthen the spine as you inhale into a diagonal position. And then exhale, rounding down again and rolling up through the spine. Upright, in breath. Exhale, as we roll down and forward, inhale. Lengthening the spine to that diagonal position. So we're adding extension here and exhale, we round back to the upright position. Again, exhale, we roll down. We lengthen the spine. Exhale, we round down and lift the spine upright. Last one, exhale, inhale. Now let's stay in that beautiful diagonal position here. Stay tall, long, 
Now rotate your body to me as you exhale. Inhale, center. Exhale. Inhale, center. Plant your heels down to the ground. Energize your legs and rotate and center. Rotate and center. Rotate and center. Now rotate to me and hold that. Now release the underneath arm, press the back of your arms against your legs. Now can we rotate our trunk a little bit more here and stretch the top arms away. Reach up tall, lengthening out a little bit more. Stay here for three, two, one. Hands behind your head, back to the middle. And other side, we rotate and arms release, bottom arm release, pressing against the leg, opening through your torso and release the top arm, reach out, stay here for three, two, one, hands behind, back to the middle and rounding the spine again, we roll up through the spine nice and tall release the arms legs together arms forward we're going to roll down all the way down to the floor take your arms down by the side and then bring the feet in taking the leg up to tabletop ready for our rollover so one leg up second leg up stretch your legs long diagonally up to the ceiling and roll over, dorsiflex, separate, lower the toes down, pressing the toes down if you can, and roll the spine back down to the floor. Release the pelvis, plantar flex, reach the legs long together. Take it up, and roll over, dorsiflex, separate, press the toes down, lifting that sitting board up to the sky, and roll the spine back. Point the feet, legs away, together. Again, two more times. In. Exhale. Dorsiflex, separate and down. And roll the spine back. Sit the pelvis down, plantar flex, reach the legs away, together. Last one, up. And roll over. Dorsiflex, separate, lower the feet down, lifting up the tailbone, sitting bone up to the sky, and roll back. Sit the pelvis down, point the feet, reach the legs away, draw the knees in, lower one foot down. Second down for our shoulder bridge. Take an in breath. Exhale, we roll up, up up anchor the foot away from me take the foot closer to me up to the sky reach up and we go exhale inhale exhale in breath exhale two more last one up, hold, point the foot, lower the legs aligned with the supporting thighs, stay there. Exhale, let's roll the spine down, back to neutral, in breath, roll it back up again, reach the thighs equally next to each other. Exhale, roll down, and exhale, roll up, stay. Lower the foot down, reestablish the pelvis position, and then we take the other leg up to the sky. And we go. Two more. Last one. And point. Lower. And we roll the spine down, in breath, exhale. We roll it up again, 
exhale, we roll it down. And we roll it back up. And then we roll it down again this time. Hold that leg there, join the other leg up. Let's take it to scissors and bicycle. We take the leg up, we roll over. Softening your knee, place your hands or small off the back. And then sit the pelvis on your hands. Extend the legs up to the sky. And we go. Two more sets. Last set. And bicycle. We tap if you can. We tap. We tap. We tap. Last set. And reverse and down. Last set. We bring both legs up and bring the legs overhead. Arms release down to the floor and we roll down, roll down. Legs up to the sky. Stay there for a moment for the corkscrew. Over to me as we inhale and down. Center, other side. Last set. Last one. And center, bend the knees. Hug the legs for a moment. Turn the head left and right. And release, lower the legs down. And let's turn the body to me for our side kick. Let me get my towel. I think it's about 27 degrees here Celsius in the Belito Island. I'm not sure what that's in Fahrenheit, but it's pretty warm. <laughs> I'm being safe, but a really lovely cool breeze from the ocean. So, all right, let's go. Lifting up the underneath waistline, work the obliques, reach the leg long. And we go, exhale, <sighs> inhale. Two more sets. Last set. Now stay at the back here. Lower the supporting arm down, the forearm down. Reach the top up diagonally. Slight internal rotation in the back leg. We lift up and up. Three more. Two. Last one, we lift and let's stay there. I like it to bring the back leg in front of you and then bring the arm at the back in a rotation here. Reach out the arm nice and long, create a beautiful straight line from the bottom supporting elbow to your fingertips and stay here for three, two, one and release. Tuck the feet in, arms up, and quick side bend or lateral stretch. Come back up at the side. Okay. All right. Let's go. And lift the leg up. Whoa, dorsi flex. And we go. Sun is becoming stronger here. Two more. Last one. Stay there. Lower the forearm down. Reach the top arm diagonally in front of you. Slight internal rotation in the back leg. We lift. Lift. Five more. Three. Last one, and then bring the back leg, the top leg forward, 
reach the top arm backward, find a beautiful rotation, find a straight line from the supporting elbow right up to the fingertips, opening across the front of the chest. Stay here for three, two, one, and return. Tuck the feet under, lift the underneath arm, reach out to the sky, a quick lateral stretch and upright. All right, let's go to a quadruped position for our cat stretch here. Aligned your shoulders to the heel of your palm, knees and the center of your hip. We in breath. Exhale as we round the spine, moving through neutral and inhale, taking our spine to a thoracic extension. And exhale through neutral into a flexion and through neutral into an extension. And again, exhale, flex, and through neutral into extension. Now here, a little variation. I like you to flex the spine and then move the pelvis back or sit the pelvis back towards the heels. You don't have to necessarily sit down on the heels, just wherever you can, keeping that deflection in the spine. And bring the body over and then through neutral, extend. And again, through neutral. And we round, flex the back, go into deflection, move the pelvis back towards the heels. Keep the hands exactly where they are or where they were. And over shoulder over the hands and in through neutral into a thoracic extension. One more time here. And, and sit the pelvis back. And through neutral into a thoracic extension. And let's go back to neutral again here. Now I'd like you to stretch the leg closer to me behind you. Hold strong in abdominal here and hip extension. We lift two, three, let's do ten of this. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now tuck the toes down. Pull up the abdominal, lift the supporting knee up, like so. Hold that center for three, two, one. Now I'd like you to rotate the lower half of the body towards me and I stretch that bottom leg long, place it on the floor, take the arm up to the sky and stay there for like what I call a star. Side plank here. Stay here for five, four, three, two, one, and return the arm back down, taking the knee in and lower the knee down. Lift the back leg up and then bring it in. Then let's switch over to the other side. So extend the leg away from me, behind you. Hip extension, lift for 10. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And then tuck the toes, place the foot down, lift the abdominal, float the supporting knee off the floor, rotate away from me, stretch the underneath leg and open the arm up to the sky. Stay here for five, four, three, two, one. Return the arm down. Come back to a front support position. Lower the knee down and bring the knee in. Tuck the toes under, lift the pelvis up to an upstretch position here. Send the sitting bone nice and high to the sky. Lift the heels as high as you can. Pressing the armpit down, 
I'd like you to try to have that little pinky pressing down to the floor. So you can engage that latissimus dorsi a little deeper in the side of the body here. And a little prancing with the legs. I'm going to lower my left heel down. Right heel stay up. And we switch. And we switch. And we switch. Two more sets. Last set. Both heels rise up nice and high. Both heels down to the ground. And let's stay here. I like it to plant the arm away from me on the floor and take the arm closer to me across an opposite ankle. Lift high. And we can rotate the body over to the open side and stay here for three, two, one. And release the arm down, switch over to the other side, release the hand and grab the outside of the ankle and stay lifted and tall. And stay for three, two, one. Release the hand and lift the heels up again, bend the knees to the panther and stay here. Push forward to the front support. And then bending the knees to the panther. And then push forward to the front support. Two more. And back. Forward. Front support. Last one. And front support and stay here. Can we descend ourselves down? In a push-up position in five count. So we go five, we go down four, we go down three, we go down two, we go down one, and we arrive on the ground. Okay, let's go to our single leg kick here. Okay, forearm pressing down to the ground firmly. Nice and strong in the upper back. Neck is long, lifting the leg up. And we go with the leg closer to me. Exhale. Inhale. Two more sets. Last set. And straighten both legs long, duck the legs together, lower the chest down, arms out to a T position, upper back is active here, palms facing down, and we slide the arms to your hips, and we open. And it's kind of like pulling straps too, on reformer. And exhale, in breath. Two more times, exhale, in breath. And last one, in breath, take the arms forward for the swimming, right arm, left leg, left arm, right leg, right arm, left leg, left arm, right leg, and we go, inhale. Three more sets. Last set, we hold, open the arms to T, falling through the elbows, press the forearm down, lower the feet down, hold the legs down, engaging the thighs still. Let's go to our high swan here. So we inhale, we glide the shoulder blades down, coming up to a beautiful maximum thoracic extension. Then we press up to wherever your body allows you today. And we come back down. Again. Energy through the legs. Inhale. Th up through the spine. And we press up. And exhale. We come down. Again. Inhale. 
can. We press up. Exhale. I come down. Last one. Inhale. We press up. Exhale. I come down. Hold on. Bring the legs together. Arms are to a T position. Bending through the knees. Grab the ankles. For our rocking prep. Let's just do three of these. I need this. <laughs> I've been carrying heavy stuff, so back extension is absolutely amazing on my back at the moment. So let's go, inhale, lift in the thigh, lift in the back, feeling very tight. Exhale, we come down again, inhale, hip extension, back extension, then knee extension, exhale, and down again, inhale. We'll lift, we'll reach, up, exhale. Let's do one more time as a bonus. I did say three, let's do four. Inhale. My body really needs this, ex need this extension. Exhale. And let it go. Release the legs, forearm to the side of your body. Push the floor away, pull in your abdominals. Sit the pelvis back to your rest position. Inhale. Exhale, two more breath. Last breath. And then let's roll the spine up. Come up to a kneeling position. Let's go to a single arm kneeling high bridge. I just named that, okay? It's not in a book, I just named that myself. So, power through the legs, through the hip extensors, arms up to the sky. And then the arm closer to me, reach it back behind you. Grab the heels, press the heel of the palm down, head up to the sky. Stay here, inhale, exhale. Two more breath. Last breath. And we come up. Other side, inhale. Heel of the palm to the heel, off your foot, and then look up to the sky. Inhale. One more breath. And lift up. And let's turn face me. All right, for side kick, kneeling side kick. Arms up to the side, over to your right, and down. Push away a little bit for a moment. Extend the leg, dorsiflex, and we go. Two more sets. Last set. And center. Place the foot down. Lift up a little higher. And then take the bottom leg behind. Reach the top arm up. Stay here for three, two, one. Now like it too, just readjust the back foot. Tuck the toes under and then swing the body to a front support position, single arm front support position and stay there for three, two, one. Rotate back to the side position. Bring the knee in. Lift up, slight, a quick lateral stretch. Come back and center. Other side, we go. And push away a little bit, extend. And we go. Two more sets, last set. Center, place the foot down, stretch the top arm up, and then bring the underneath leg behind. Reach up, stay here. For three, two, and one, and readjust the back foot, rotate, swivel the body 
two of front support. Single arm front support position. Stay for three, two, one. Back to the side position. Bottom leg down. Lift up. Lateral stretch. And let's finish the class with a seal puppy. Okay. I was planning to do a very short class. I have no idea how long I've been moving here. So we'll figure out <laughs> in a bit. So let's go. Seal puppy. So hand over, hand over, diamond leg position. Pulling into the center. Take a moment, reset yourself. And when you're ready, let's go. We we'll roll back. Clap, one, two, three. Two more sets. Last. And stay. Now let's hold on to this position for a second, this shape. I'd like you to take a moment, take a little quiet time here for yourself. Listen to your breath. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Deepening. your center, lifting through the spine, finding that balance from the mind, with the mind and the body. Now let's lower your feet down or legs down. Inhale, exhale, we roll our spine down, allow the arms to go with the body. Inhale, the bottom. Exhale, we roll up through the spine, sitting up nice and tall. In breath. Exhale, let's roll down one more time. Allow the arms to go with the body. In breath. Exhale. And rolling up tall. Sitting up nice and tall, perching on your sitting bone. Let's take one deep inhalation with me. And one long exhalation. And you are all done. Thank you for joining me on my morning practice. I hope you have a lovely practice and I wish you a lovely day. Thank you. Congratulations on completing the class. Well done. I'm Mira and I'm here to help you to look and feel your absolute best through Pilates. If you enjoyed this video, you will love my free Better Postures in 5 Days program. Click the first link in the comments and sign up. I will instantly send you a daily email with a 15 to 20 minute workout each day. This workout will work your whole body to help open, stretch and strengthen your posture. Your spine and body will love you. Don't forget to like and comment with any question you may have about Pilates. Subscribe and turn on notification so you don't miss any of my free Pilates video. See you in the next class.